So you probably know Netflix CE, the only working free Roblox buy from Bypass for the website and Microsoft Store version of Roblox. And in today's video, I'll show you a newer version of it, Netflix CE V2, so the second version. It's more stable, gives less errors, and jacks faster and overall safer to use. It's the only working buy from Bypass for Roblox that works on the web version and also on the UWP version. In today's video, I'll show you how to execute scripts on the web version of Roblox using Netflix CEV2. So let's get right into it. So the only thing that you're going to need is going to be this file right here. You can get it on my website, omgexploits.com. It's really easy to get and then you will just have it like this. After that, just right click on it and then extract to Netflix CEV2. And then here you have it. Now you can just open it. And then in the readme file, in the readme file here you have some information. The game link is uh, disabled, so it's not going to be this one. I'm going to put another one in the description, which one to use. And also make sure to join my Discord server for uh, if you need support or help with anything at all. And credits go to Jotun. So after you open the Netflix CEV2 folder, here it is, it's going to be right here, the Netflix process handler and also the Netflix x86. I recommend using the Netflix process handler because this makes it crash less and it makes it more stable. But you can also open this one if this doesn't work. So there is going to be two parts to this tutorial. So the main method, which works for most of the games, also a method that makes it work for Blade Ball. So first, I'm going to show you the main method that works on most of the games. So you're just going to need to open one of these. I'm just after that. Here it is. Now just open Roblox. So this is the game that you have to join. So this is the only working game that you have to join. You have to join this. Otherwise, it won't work. So just uh, join it. Make sure your Netflix CE is opened and just wait for it to open. After it opened, you will see this right here. So in here, you will select which game you want to join. If the game that you're trying to join isn't here, just open Roblox on the website version and then search for a game that you want to join. Let's say you want to join Blocks Fruits or anything else. You just copy this ID right here. So in the URL it, and then put it in here. You can then just paste it in here and then join game. So make sure to do that. After that, this will open. So first, make sure to select. It. So after you're here, make sure you are inside the game and you have a tool just like I have right here. So make sure you have something in here, just like a fruit or just your combat, your normal fist. So anything in here and then it will be able to inject. After I just open the Netflix CEV2, just press on this right here and then select Roblox right here. After that, this will open. You can put it like this and then just press on inject right here. And in here, you will see whatever it does. So if you can see it got the, the script and when it's saying inject script, that means it's working. So if you can see it got the tool, it got the pole for me. So it's going to be this right here. So whenever you equip it, if you can see this GUI will open. So this is actually the executor. And also with some other scripts right here and also has a big script hub. If you can see a pretty big script hub with a lot of things such as universal aimbot, uh, ability changer, tool movement, spin hack, Fulbright, infinite jump, x-ray, NTFK, FPS booster and a lot more. Also infinite yield. So let me try out the infinite yield. So I'm just going to execute it. And if you can see, it's going to be right here. Here. This is also going to be a Bloxfruits ESP right here. Just going to press on it and then execute. And this is for any fruits that are on the map at the moment. But if you can see, there aren't any fruits on the map, which is really sad. You can also in, uh, execute a fly script if you can see, which actually works. Then you can select fly and now you can fly. You can also change the speed of how fast you want to fly if you can see. So this is pretty OP. It has a lot of stuff like an universal aimbot. You can execute that as well. So now it will have an universal aimbot for players. If I go to the script hub right here, uh, you will also find a headbox extender. So you can execute that and it will extend the headbox of players. If you can see, this is his uh, headbox that just got extended. So now I can hit him from here. If you can see from uh, further away, I don't have to be close to him or whatever. There is a full bright script. There is also x-ray if you want to do that and you can press x to x-ray if you can see. Now I can see through the map and also see wherever I want to see if there is something down there, if you can see. That's also a tool movement GY, if you can see. I'm not sure 
why you're gonna use this fe flips fully loaded if you can see and now you can just press x and if you can see it will do a backflip just like that there is also a front flip and also c2 infinite jump so now you have like an infinite jumping method <laughs> or you can just do this so this is pretty op and so many more that you can actually use there is also a god mode if you can see so let me there is also a murder mystery 2 esp as well but let me try out the blocks fruits esp so let's see if this actually works so you can close this as well by pressing that and then you can open it again by pressing p if you can see so i'm just gonna close it and let's see if there are any fruits it just, just it should just uh, pop out the text you can also do no clip using this right here so no clip and then enter and now i can go through stuff if you can see and uh, no one else can so this is pretty cool as well you trying to follow me so now i'm going to show you the method which makes it work for blade ball so the first thing that you need to do is going to be to open the netflix v 2 folder you're going to scroll down and you will see right here where is it roblox bb dot lua just put a you're just gonna put it on top of your desktop just like that and then you're gonna go into the auto run folder inside the netflix cv2 so just open the auto run and then you're gonna search for roblox.lua you're gonna also put it on your desktop then you're gonna replace it with a roblox bb like this and then inside the home folder of the netflix ce where uh, where you can find the netflix and netflix process handler you're just gonna put this roblox right here and now you can just open it just like that and now it will work for blade ball as well let me show it to you guys you're just gonna join the game that i told you about you're gonna select blade ball you can just you can also copy the numbers from inside the url and then you just press on join game and now if you can see we are right here so before you do anything make sure you have the dash ability equipped so then you will select the roblox just like i said from this uh, right here so make sure you have the dash ability equipped and then you're just gonna press on inject just like that and then you're gonna need to wait it takes a bit longer to inject so if you can see it just injected inside blade ball so whenever a new game starts just like that if you can see it opens so now i can open this really fast and then enable the uh, blade ball auto parry right here so i'm gonna execute it if you can see if you can see it just auto parried and i killed someone it's gonna come again for me so i can just leave it and it's gonna do it for me i just eliminated uh, someone again so let me also execute the fly script which is right there so i can just wait it's gonna come again for me so i just have to wait and then bam it just did it and i killed someone again so let me fly just like that so no one can get really close to me so i can just stay like this and it will kill everyone so you can actually win with this and this actually works after the new uh, after the after the new update on blade ball for the winter there is also an ability changer for blade ball is gonna be right here you can change to Dun thunder dash if you can see and i actually don't have it you can change to telekinesis super jump shadow step rage deflection which is really op so if you have any problems injecting in blade ball make sure that while it's injecting you're not joining a game so actually playing down there so make sure while it's injecting you're gonna be staying right here so what i what i recommend to do is to just join a blade ball game like i did before with uh, through my game and then just wait a bit until the game finishes and then you're gonna try to die early on so die as fast as possible and then when you spawn right here when you're spectating then you're gonna then you're gonna select roblox and then you're gonna press on inject because otherwise you will get an error because if it's um if it's if you press inject and while it's injecting and it doesn't say inject script so while it's at the zero or or got results and if you then join a game so then if you're right there then it will give you an error because it didn't work so you have to be on this platform the whole time it injects so i guess this was the video don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and i'll see you guys in my next video